Bedside Cabaret is bringing a vintage song and dance entertainment into hospital wards and care settings and actually visiting patients and residents in their bedsides, so going into wards or going into separate rooms to bring entertainment to people that cannot access the sort of communal areas. We are the Mary Lou Review and we are here to offer you some musical refreshment, totally free of charge. Now, sir, hiding in the corner there, would you like to pick out a bag? <laughs> Pick out any bag, it's a lucky dip. Now have a look inside, there's a piece of paper with a song written on it. What have we got? Bare necessities. The bare necessities of life will come to you. They'll come to you. Let's do it again. You look for the bare necessities, the simple bare necessities. Forget about your worries and your strides. Yes, necessities. No I've survived two of those tours, I reckon they go home now. <laughs> yeah, it's a different experience. Generally, every day is the same, and you know, it can be kind of the same for staff and for patient. Um, and just to see something happening that raises the patient's curiosity into what's going on, it's a different sort of interaction, a different part of the socialisation process. In, you know, watch their faces and you see them curious about what the people are wearing. You know, just now with the lady dancing her feet, you could just see people looking down. How do they do that? Mm. And it brings forward memories from their past and we can discuss now and then bring it to the future as well. So it gives us a different perspective of that person, seeing them holistically rather than just as a patient. I think sometimes being in hospital is not always, well it's not fun is it, I mean we're, they're here and they're often sat waiting um, for things to happen so I think when somebody different comes in and just injects that, that enthusiasm and a bit of fun and laughter um, and engagement I think that's just the most important thing I think. But it takes it makes you out of this revolting boring room which is a medical place to do something jolly and that seems good. So as part of the Creating with Care programme we have been collecting evidence uh, from all of our sessions and what we find is that patients start off um, uh, maybe being quiet or um, asleep but at the end of a session are quite engaged and so their happiness score does go up after having an arts intervention and uh, over the course of the time that the Mary Lou uh, Review will be doing their bedside cabaret with us we will also be looking at this evidence but so far what we've got suggests that patients are more relaxed afterwards and they have felt distracted from the hospital environment. Hello Ivy. Hello. My name's Stephen. Oh, I'm wondering what is this all about? Well, well hopefully. Let the stormy clouds chase. Do 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 do. Here we go. Splish splosh. We have a lot of residents here on the care floor who um, are in their rooms, mainly because some of them don't like to socialise too much in a lounge. The show that we've seen today is absolutely incredible. Um, the interaction of Steve and Mary Lou with the residents is so um, so calming for them, but also real fun. They go in with this energy. Beautiful. which just transfers to the resident. They're marvellous chatting with them. They will ask some questions about their life and which they haven't met these residents before but immediately can relate to them. But props come along as well so we might have feathers, there were scarves, lots of things and the dancing is incredible. Their costumes are marvellous, they were colourful and 
everyone, it just brings a smile to everyone's face. Uh, we also had a family of one of our residents in, so there was the daughter-in-law and two of the residents' grandchildren. They were there, Mary Lou gave them some uh, shakers and scarves, and they were joining in with their granddad, which was just lovely to see. So Steve and Mary Lou make it very personal for each resident that, that we've seen them go into today. Um, they've looked around the residents' room and been able to pick up on something that is from their past and been able to talk to them about that and even linked a song to that. Yeah.